the biggest problem Fortnite has been having, bro? The game was gone for two days and they had over 100,000 people sitting in a screen staring at a booty hole. All right, YouTube, it's about that time. Look, I've done some heavy thinking the past week and we're growing at a steady pace, man. And first off, let me say thank you guys for the people who continue to sub, watch my videos, tell your friends about me. Yo, I appreciate it. As you guys well know, we always stream on mixer.com slash invade. So slide through, show your boys some love if you want to. But I've been doing some heavy thinking and honestly, I think I'm about to do what I didn't think I was gonna do for a long time. And I think I'm gonna release my jump shot. Also, if you guys could do me a big favor, man, if you guys could go when you're on Xbox, type in my gamer tag, that's soar space invade, add me on Xbox, favor me on Xbox. You guys will see when I go live on Mixer as well. Here's what's gonna happen. If we can get this video to 500 likes, I kid you not, if we get to 500 likes, the next video that I release will be my jump shot i will tell you guys the jump shot that i am currently using so make sure to smack that like button leave a comment and make sure you click the sub button today's video is literally going to be based off of what's been going on with 2k man and i'm just going to be honest with y'all bro as much as i love the 2k franchise much as i love it it's like i said in my in my rent video it feels like they don't even care about their game and it's getting point it's getting to the point to where it's hard to even like defend them anymore you know like you guys didn't know there was literally a somehow somehow the holiday clothes got released in october by holiday i mean christmas and somehow it got released but get this first off it don't even make sense how that got released how does that even happen how do you release content for christmas in october you ain't even changed the court in the freaking park the freaking park yet and you already got the holiday you didn't even go to thanksgiving yet you skipped straight to christmas come on cuz what do you mean 2k but get this not that we'd want the park change anyway because it's probably gonna lag and gonna have a lot of issues anyway but get this the crap said 2018 happy holiday 2018 happy holidays which means they didn't even try to make new stuff for christmas for 2020 they didn't even try to make new stuff it said 2018 happy holidays which means they were recycle i mean they already we already knew they were recycling their stuff but they're not even trying to hide it anymore they're allowing they're just doing whatever the freak they want to do at this point it doesn't matter if we play the game or if we don't play the game they don't care, and I feel like they don't care because of the simple fact that they have no competition. I said this in my earlier video, it is strictly based off of the fact that they only have one game that's, that's NBA that we can really play. Live has not shown that they are capable of creating a good basketball game yet. EA has not shown that. 2K, regardless of the stuff that we get, it's overall a decently well played gameplay wise basketball game it's just the crap that we deal with is a slap in all of the consumers faces man it's a slap in their faces the slap in my face and dude, i don't know i don't know uh where to go from from here man i i honestly all we can do is keep playing it or not play it that's literally what it comes out to you guys already know fortnite came out with that chapter too uh, and to me, it was a fun game. I might even release a video. Let me know in the comment section if y'all would like some Fortnite content. I know we a 2K uh, channel, but let me know if y'all would like some Fortnite content, man. Uh, if y'all would like that, then I already got videos lined up for that. But man, it is tough, bro. It's tough. We got we got latencies for every freaking mode. We got one for Park. We got one for Program 3v3. We got one for the Rec Center. And then we got one for the 5v5 uh, program as well. So like it's just different it's everything is different man and as much as i want to play this game i promise you as much as i want to play this game it's getting harder and harder to do so because of so much stuff it's like they're, they're literally throwing it in our faces and so the, the the thing that i have right now that i'm struggling with and i'm just gonna be honest with y'all bro because one of the things y'all gonna learn about me is i'm completely honest 
thing that I'm struggling with is is the trying to figure out am I going to grind this game even with the state that it's in because I feel like if I continue to grind it a lot of people start quitting that that's even more of a way for me to continue to grow but at the same time I am not enjoying the game so if I'm not enjoying it to the point to where that then I'm just throwing out content you know what I mean and I don't know man I I, I generally don't know y'all let me know what y'all think bro let me know in the comment section if y'all think Number one, if I should drop some Fortnite content. Number two, if I should keep grinding 2K. Because I can do that, dog. I can do that for y'all. I can do that for my homies. I can keep playing. I can keep going. If we get the support to keep going, bro, I'm going to keep going, dog. But, man, this is, it's, it's like, a, like I said, bro, it's a complete slap in the face that they continue to just let things like this happen. Um, and as much as I would love a logo, as much as I would love to be a part of their you know 2k tv and things like that or even just growing the youtube community in general man it is hard because bro like come on throw us a bone or something bro i'm not gonna sit here and just sit on my butt and be like this game is a great game right now because it's not man overall gameplay it is but bro when you're dealing with the same stuff over and over again like imagine if fortnite had released uh chapter two or whatever and the game was in a totally broken state like a totally broken state the, the vast the biggest problems that they've been having is frame issues we get frame issue problems every day in the freaking 2k game that's the biggest problem fortnite has been having bro the game was gone for two days and they had over a hundred thousand people sitting in a screen staring at a booty hole And that just goes to show like this is so much stuff that we can do better man but like i said if we get this video to 500 likes the next video that you guys will see will be based off of what my jump shot is what i came up with and what i like about it and all that type of stuff i will release it tomorrow let's try to get to 20k subscribers i was gonna drop it at 20k anyway um but let's try to get to 20k subscribers keep the video or keep the subs coming keep the likes and the comments coming and uh, let's go crazy, man. I'm going to keep playing this game. Like I said, I'm streaming on Mixer.com slash Invade. Uh, I'll be live tonight on some 2K. I have played Fortnite. I'm enjoying that, too. So you'll see a little bit of Fortnite and 2K, uh, but predominantly more 2K than Fortnite because I'm just not as good as what I used to be. But I do do still love the game. It's a lot of fun to play. Uh, but yeah, let's get it bopping and uh, let's have some fun. Other than that, uh, I'll see you guys next video. And again, let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Peace.